attention. Sam is one of those rarities. He has an amazing voice. It's all about his voice. He doesn't express himself with acting or with dancing or with his clothes. If I'm honest, I find a little kind of goes a long way. It's, it really affects me. I really feel it. I really feel the emotion behind his, his singing. When you listen to Sam's music, you feel it. Granny might think, oh my God, his voice is amazing. He sings like an angel. So he appeals to everyone, to every audience. And it's kind of extraordinary for this generation that he wasn't th found through a TV medium. As a teenager, Sam gravitated towards the music of Beyonce and singing legends Whitney Houston and Mariah Carey. Beyonce in there, you've got all the divas, Whitney Houston, he was massively, massively inspired by those women. Since hitting the big time, the singer-songwriter has undergone something of a transformation. I've definitely seen a style transformation in Sam since he's hit the big time. You know, he's definitely taking this fashion thing and I'm sure that's a lot to do with his weight loss. He's suddenly thinking, I can be a gay icon, I can be really good looking and I can wear designer clothes. He's really into fashion. He absolutely loves being front row at Burberry. He's a bit of a sucker for designer labels. I think he likes his designer clothes a lot. You know, he's on first name terms with Anna Winter, the editor of American Vogue. Designers are throwing clothes at him. Burberry are throwing clothes at him. He got sponsored by Calvin Klein for his American tour. That's a huge deal. He's definitely modeled himself on a young Frank Sinatra. You can see that with his hairstyle, it's almost identical. It's very much that Rat Pack look. It's about the sharp suits, the hair. It's really the first time we've seen a pop star advocating that kind of smart look, which is a conservative look, which is really super chic and not about rebelling and not about ripped jeans and tattoos. And it's a different way of expressing yourself, which let's face it, grannies and mothers would love. He would just look like a Muppet if he was dressed in a cape and was dancing around in kind of cowboy boots or something. It just, it wouldn't work. Sam's preferred designers are your classics your Gucci, your Armani, a little bit of Alexander McQueen, Calvin Klein. He wears a lot of Burberry because Burberry are very, very supportive of the music industry and especially up and coming talent. So it works very well that Sam would become a Burberry muse. We might even see Sam in their ad campaigns. He's got a very strong sense of style, so we might well see him do collaborations with high street stores, I think he really wants his own brand. He's talked about that before. 